But Mark, it's a bit of a tough night at the office. Um, yeah, we, we always knew that playing against Gloucester would be immensely tough tonight. Um, they're the Rain and JP Morgan Sevens champions for a reason, and pretty much the same squad were, you know, we played against us this evening. So it was, we knew it was going to be a tough task, but we probably you know, forced the ball a little bit too much in those first game when we had the ball. We didn't look after it well enough, and we probably didn't really give a good account of ourselves. Um, so moving on from that, we talked about sort of fixing up those things and, and moving on to the Leicester match. Obviously, an East Midlands derby, and we started off really well, and then in the second half, in hard, in hard conditions, didn't quite control the ball well enough, bounced the ball a couple of times off our uh, off our chest, and they capitalised on those mistakes. But um, yeah, all in all, a tough evening. In the end, do you think a, almost a lack of sevens experience told tonight? Yeah, um, it, we knew it was going to be tough losing some of our England under 18 boys going away to, to South Africa on Sunday, so we didn't want to risk any injury with those guys. Um, people like Harry Mallander and Lewis Ludlam were, did exceptionally well for us, and you, know, you lose a little bit of that continuity moving forward to this week. Um, but hey, we'll learn from our mistakes, and we, we know that you know, for us it's about developing individuals and, and, and hopefully these guys will get another chance at it, at it next year and, and learn from their mistakes. I was going to come on to the youngsters involved. You had the likes of Will Allman and, and George Cox, you know, guys who are still in the junior academy playing alongside you know, ex more experienced first team, first team players like Tamana Harrison and, and Glenn Dixon. What, what do they get out of, a, out of an event like tonight? Yeah, so you look at the team tonight, we had three of our under 18s in there and uh, people like Tim Cardle's done a whole pre-season with a senior squad and Will Allman and George Cox have stepped up really well tonight and I'm a big believer that for them to, to test themselves and to get better they've got to play and they've got to train with better people and this puts them in an environment that they can do that. And also to, to learn from new experiences in terms of playing against opponents they would not otherwise face. Yeah, exactly. So they, they play in a tough competition like this, they learn from it, they get the experience it, and then they drop that back down to the under 18s and hopefully they can take that experience and those leadership qualities that they've picked up in this environment and, and pass it on to the younger guys.